Hello, we're here, we're at Costco. We're gonna get everything we need for another week. We're gonna see what kind of deals we can find. There's a bunch of sales that started, but my whole crew is with me today because we are going grocery shopping. Let's go in. I think there's, how many children today? Nine, 10? 10. 10, there's 10. Okay, let's go. Are you ready to go? Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Thank you, sir. Kids crawling on Madeline. Wow. Sorry. <laughs> Cecilia. Ready? Want me to hold your hand? Yes, it's okay. Claudia, <laughs> Hannah, Thomas, Julia, <laughs> Sophia. Here we go. We're going into Costco. We're going into Costco. We're going to find good stuff. Yeah, we do. <laughs> supposed to get, I believe it's like, I don't know. Some people are getting 10 inches. Some people are getting 4 inches of snow. See what happens in a day and a half. I think we only need one card. Who yeah. wants to grab a card, Thomas? We're going to grab two of them. We need two cards. Okay, so looks like the Ziploc sandwich bags are on sale. Just walking in, we noticed these. Takes us a really long time to go through these, but they're really nice to have. Oh, these have the sliders. Yeah. So the sandwich bags are $10.49, so $3.30 off through the 21st. And then the Ziploc variety packs are $3.80 off. And then there's more over here. So today I'm going to share with you all of the finds going on right now here at Costco. So Ziploc bags for the freezer, that's a really good deal. 152 of them for $13.99, $3.80 off. The quartz again, and then like a variety pack is on sale. So I don't know if we need these. We typically do when they're on sale, we grab them. If you do like freezer meal cooking, these are the best ever. Um, and I think we're going to do some of that. In 2024, I've challenged myself to do freezer cooking meals. I've, we usually don't do them. We just cook every single day, which I love. I love to be in the kitchen, so it doesn't bother me. But I would like to do some freezer cooking meals. And we're at Costco. Mesmerized, mesmerized. Okay, so I know a lot of people like to go ahead and grab things like this, like the Made Good Granola Minis. It looks really good on the outside. USA Organic, nut-free, nutrients and vegetables, all that good stuff. But if you flip it over and you look, so it has cane sugar. I don't want the second ingredient in my food to be cane sugar. And there's the sunflower oil. Um, you want to stay away from sunflower oil because it is a seed oil and then down below here you can see the natural flavors so i would not pick this up we're not doing processed food anyways for the next three months but that is not something that i would buy another thing i would avoid it looks like it'd be something good probiotic granola the usd organic but if you look at the ingredients check it out right here it has the second ingredient again is cane sugar then we have soy oil that's another seed oil vanilla flavor so what would stop me from buying this is the cane sugar and then the soy oil we make our own granola but i know a lot of people gravitate towards this because it says ancient grains probiotic granola organic so they just think this is a really good choice it's a better choice than buying you know the quaker oats it's all you know gmo and filled with all kinds of things okay we're gonna grab paper because you always grab paper $9.99 definitely a staple from Costco do we need more paper yeah. for all of your printing needs you're taking my card away so we're looking at all the jewelry so sapphire was my color and they have some really pretty rings blue topaz is beautiful and they have all the diamonds I was looking at this one over here this one over here for just to have a second ring in my finger I like that. It's really pretty. Oh, that one's right there. They're super pretty. And that one's really pretty. They're all so pretty. Okay, so we are going to get a Japanese mattress this year. Um, actually, this week. But I think I like these sheets. Year. And I know we're going to need a sheet to put on it. Don't you guys love that? Do you guys like that? Is that going to match my room okay? I think so. Show me the one you like better. I like those two better. These two better. Okay, yeah, wait, hold on. Let's hurry. You get to break it up. Come here. Help me out. Okay, do you like 
Any of these. We have one in the cart that's like a paisley. And then we have these over here. What do you think? Any of them or none of them are your thing? My vote's one of those two. I like the gray flower one. The that one, one up, up there top, is yeah. better than... Can you show the one in the cart? That's cute. I like that one. But that doesn't match, does it? No, it matches. They both pretty. match. That one's cute. This, that would be th cute th this is spring. like, I don't think I like that. No, I don't like that one either. This, this is what Dad could talk to you. Perfect. Thank okay. you. All right. Ooh, nice. So many neat things at Costco. Love that shower head. We have that Kohler shower head. Works really well. Love it. Okay, our list is not super long. I already see something that we need. We're going to get some grapes. I'm going to get some green grapes or do you want red grapes? Red grapes, okay. These are ginormous grapes. Good heavens. Okay, we're going to do the organic ones. Well, I'm trying to find one they're good. huge, aren't they? They're big. These are huge. That doesn't that's look that too good. Way. That's better. Yeah, those look good. good. Perfect. All right, so I'm going to grab some tomatoes. Um, let's see. I really like this company. They're non-GMO. I think one box should be plenty, right? Yeah, one box would be good. Okay, and those are $6.99 for two pounds. These are really good as well. I like these a lot too, but we're gonna get the ones with like the multiple color tomatoes. Those are equally delicious. So we need the yellow onions. So they're $4.49 for the yellow. How much are the red ones? $8.49. Nope, the yellow ones. These are the yellow, these are the Vidalia, like the sweet or the sweet ones. Yeah, we need some of the red as well. Just one bag, just one bag. Yep. Thank you. Huh? Awesome, thank you. Okay, I had to put my coat on to come into the super cold room. All right, so we're gonna grab the cucumbers over here. Um, we're gonna grab, let's grab two things of cucumbers. These are still $5.99 for three of them. We're gonna work our way down here. Let's grab one bag of celery. So we have, because we're making broth. Celery is how much? $6.29. And then we need one thing of spinach. How much is a spinach right now? $5.99. $5.99, okay, perfect. Oh, there's our cart. There's our cart. And organic blueberries are still crazy high. So these are $10.99, but we need fresh blueberries for snacking. So I want to get, oh, these are all open. Ooh, let's go down here. There you go. Oh, there's blueberries everywhere. Here we go. We just grab this one. Do you need just one? So it is nine seventy nine for fresh blueberries. Crazy, crazy price. Do you price. need um, mixed greens? Would you like mixed greens? It says on the list. So I'm yeah, oh, then yes, we need it. Yes, thank you, sweetheart. We need it then. Thanks, Hannah. All right, I think we're done in here, guys. That was fast. It's cold, oh, Sophie. Okay, we are gonna get some lemons. We get some lemons, Sophia. Yeah. We need some lemons. Are they really heavy? You want to come over here and I'll give them to you. Here she comes. There you go. Thank you. So we won't be getting anything over here. Bagels or anything like that. This is all processed food. How low our grocery bill goes without buying prepackaged processed anything. So far, I've been really pleased. If you saw our Trader Joe's video, we really, <laughs> my bill was like, way under 200 which is awesome okay we're gonna buy peppers would you like to get out can you let her up please come here my she's child. like i'd like to get out okay so mini peppers 6.99 these are really good with cream cheese one of my favorite snacks so we're gonna get one of those and then i'm gonna grab one of the peppers then my daughter was kind enough to remember that i'm not eating any bread so these are for like tuna pepper cups or to have with a meal. So yum. I love peppers. I don't think I could ever not eat peppers. I don't know. Okay, so I ordered some of the drumsticks from Thrive Market, but I don't think we ordered enough. So I'm gonna get one more package here. So I'm just gonna get one more and these are so reasonable. $1.99 a pound and that's five pounds. So I'm gonna get some of this chicken. Thank you. Five pounds. You you're so welcome. Oh. That's what I'm here for. Okay, I'm also gonna pick up some lamb chops. So I'm getting lamb chops for my husband this week. Um, this isn't on the menu. You like lamb chops? Will you have a lamb chop with daddy? And then we're gonna keep the bones for bone broth. What do you think? Is that good? Good stuff. Wow. Okay. 
Do you have a bag? Thank you. Just one. When we do buy lamb chops for our family, we need like three of them, right? When everyone's eating them, we need three. That's gross. Don't poke at him. That's Why? gross. That's just gross. Okay, so here they have prepared meatballs, $14.99, so $7.49 a pound. None of the meat I buy to make my meatballs is $7.49 a pound. So, and if you look at the ingredients, what you have in here is organic chicken, sea salt, organic spices, vinegar, organic garlic, organic extract of rosemary. The chicken is organic, which is great. So, I mean, if you're in a pinch, you just don't have time to make your own meatballs. Not a bad deal. $14.99 for 32 ounces, so two pounds. It is always cheaper and better to make it yourself, but it's a good option though if you are in a pinch and you need something fast. And the reason why I'm always looking at ingredients, because here is the same company, right? Check it out, girls. Same company, you would think, oh, all their stuff's gonna be clean and you know, it's gonna be great. You look down here, look at the ingredients. Okay, so here you've got chicken raised without antibiotics. So it's not organic chicken. It's got soybeans in it, it's got sugar in it, it's got pineapple flavor in it. So you just, you can't look at one product from the same company and think it's gonna be okay across the board because those were pretty clean. Okay, so we're gonna get the cheesy balls. They are $9.89. Sophia's very excited about this. I'm not sure if that's on our list today. Where did you go? There you are. <laughs> cheesy balls. Yeah, cheesy balls. Okay, I'm gonna pick up some of this cheese right here. This is a exclusive selective, I believe this is the raw milk from Switzerland. So yes, this is aged eight months, made with raw milk. This is one of my favorite cheeses next to the Kerrygold. Can you put this in the cart, my love? Sure. Thank you. And then we're gonna get the Kerrygold. We get two of those. Okay, so two carry gold for the week. So this is all the cheese we need for the week. I don't have my menu on me, so I can't tell you precisely what um, all the cheese goes with, but I always share with you at the end of the video, and I go over everything we bought, and then I go over what we're using it on, and all that good stuff. And then down below in the description, I will add this week's menu for you. What are you looking at? Okay, they have on sale right now until the 21st. These are the organic avocado mash cups. These are so good if you're looking for something to take on the road with you, put in lunch boxes, or just have that fresh avocado when you need it. I wish they weren't in plastic, but they are. But sometimes these turn out to be better. And even buying the avocado, because they stay nice and fresh in there until you open it. The ingredients are super clean and they're on sale. So this makes a really good snack. This technically, is not too processed but because they're in like individual cups i don't know what do you think cj is that being processed is this a processed food i think it is yeah it's, it's kind like... of a processed food except the only ingredients in it is avocado lemon sea salt and black pepper yeah. what do you guys think is this processed i think i'm gonna get anyways for my husband for work for some dipping and so and at that price that is crazy this would all be considered processed food in my eyes these are definitely all processed foods and then over here what are you looking at it's looking like food Oh. Garlic seasoned party wings and salmon, and then they have gyros, different kinds of stuff. You can get chili here, salads, and stuffed bell peppers. Costco doesn't miss a beat, they think of everything. Food salad. Food salad. Well, no, that's just a salad. Okay, so we're gonna get one thing of the napkins. We probably buy this, I don't know, once a year. We really don't go through a lot of napkins. $11.99, boys. Okay, we're gonna grab some toilet paper because we grab this every single month. And then we're gonna grab, do we need paper towel? Grace? No, okay, no, we, we had to call the house and make sure. Let's go. Ooh, are they on sale? They're on but sale. Sponges, yes. $10.99 for the Scotch Bright. Nice. Yes. When things are on sale, we pick them up because they don't go on sale all the time. $4 off. 
Good was a good deal even without the sale. We're looking for bleach. We're getting a lot of the uh, like once a year things. Oh, they have the scrub daddies, which I love. I so tempting just to get the scrub daddies. Mm. Girls, you do dishes. Did you like the scrub daddies? Scrub daddies. Let's do the blue ones. They both were fine. It's the first time I've seen empty shelves at Costco. I don't think I've ever been here where they didn't have like racks full of stuff. Not all the aisles are like this. I mean, they have plenty of stuff. But there's either it was a really busy weekend or I don't know everyone needed like cleaning supplies for the new year. We do need lint rollers. $9.89. Oh, they're $3.10 off. So let's get one because we have three fur babies. Ooh, we could how many do you get in there? He looks four, like five. No, five. five. No, no, it has a handle in it. Oh, okay, five. So you get five. Nice, nice. Yeah, we're just restocking all kinds of things today. Yeah, I'm not sure if $18.99 is a good price for bleach. This is how often you do not buy bleach. I remember when bleach for one bottle was like a dollar, like no more than two. So $18.99 for three things of bleach. Let me know down below in the comments. Is that a good deal? I don't know. We're buying it here anyways as we always buy it here, but wow, it seems really expensive. Thomas, what's on your sweater? Can I see it? And you got that for Christmas? Mm -hmm. That's really cool. And Alex is wearing a matching sweater. Alex, can I see what's on your sweater? That's cool. So all of this would be processed drinks and things like that. So we're not gonna go down that aisle. Let's go see what they have in the freezer section. Let's see if they have anything on sale. Can you see all the people? There are so many people. Oh, it's all processed. Not that we would buy this anyways. We don't normally buy these things. Okay, so I'm looking for grass-fed burgers. We used some grass-fed burgers in our life. Thank you, Sophia. Sophia's gonna grab one at four seventy-nine a pound. Can she get it? Does she need Big Brother help? No, she's got it. And tie up. Alex has the other one. Thank you, guys. Perfect. So, I feel like we need more than two because everyone eats burgers at night. Let's just grab one more and then we maybe don't have to buy one next week. This way we have it. There we go. Never know. Then we're going to get some blueberries. So I need some blueberries. Which one? Let's get the wild blueberries up top. The dark bag. Because I have children that love blueberries. And they just eat lots of blueberries. Perfect. Oh my goodness, my monkeys are hanging from everything. Okay, yes baby. We cannot open that because that's where the employees work. I know, what a bummer, such a bummer. Oh yeah, he was restocking? Yes. Okay, we don't have this on the menu, but I don't think we have any at home. So I'd like to have some mixed vegetables on the side just to have it. So we'll get one bag of the veggie stir fry. Perfect. Okay, I'm also gonna grab some broccoli. It's always good to have vegetables in the house because my kids love them. And we'll just open this bag up and have it with lunch or dinner with any meal. Same with the broccoli. We don't need any of this though, we need peas or anything like that. We're good? Uh, yeah, I think we're good, yeah. Cool, let's keep moving. Oh, there's the green beans. Oh. We haven't had green beans here in a while. Well, you have snap green beans on the menu, and I don't, snacks, and okay. they don't They don't have them here, so let's get the frozen ones. Is it good? Yeah, it's okay, perfect. Are we getting how many bags? Just, Just one. one. Let's make sure there's no oils in there. Yes, you never know. You we're know? green beans. Awesome. Nice. And then we need Polish sausages. These are seven fifty-five a pound. And what I like about these is that they're 100% grass-fed beef, pasture-raised the way nature intended, fully cooked. My kids love them, and they're super delicious. Just one will do. We're gonna have cauliflower rice bowls for lunch. So we got some of this grass-fed beef, pasture-raised Polish sausage. Okay, so I keep forgetting this is over here. This is the wild sockeye salmon filet, previously frozen. Proud to the USA, boneless, skin on. I'm looking to make sure there's no color added, and there is not. Thank you for pointing this out because I 
keep forgetting this is here. So this is $9.99 a pound for the wild sockeye. What a great deal. And you can always just like cut these up yourself and pre-portion them, just perfect. What you shouldn't buy when you come here though, this is $11.99. This is fresh Atlantic salmon and it says filet farm raised. Now it's coming from Norway, which is great. And I wouldn't buy this because it has been farm raised and again, colored throughout the feed. So if you wanted to buy one, I would buy this one. Okay, so my last Costco haul, I said when I come back, I was gonna load up, $5 off. So it's $28.99 for three pounds of the sockeye. So I'm gonna get two of these. You guys wanna go look at books? We may not be able to buy one, but we'll look at them first, okay? It's a no, yes, that's how it works. Very good. Look at books right there. Wow, the human body. You can learn about your lungs, muscles, organs. That's awesome. Yeah, Cecily was looking at this last time we were here. Hey, a dog whose brain has a bit of a head. Yep, those are stickers. They have stickers in it. Stickers. Yeah, lots of stickers. So the one thing that I love about Costco is they do so well at bringing in really good snacks. This is definitely one of them. These are the organic sprouted pumpkin seeds. Now it's just sea salt and pumpkin seeds. These are great in trail mix. I put these in smoothies, salad, anything like that. You can see on the back here, one quarter cup is only three grams of carbs and two of the dietary fiber. But you're also getting, look at the potassium and phosphorus, the magnesium, the zinc, the copper, the manganese. There's so much in here. This is another really good snack here at Costco. So no sugar added fruit rolls. This is the bear. And if you flip it over to the back, you can see those ingredients. Um, all you're getting is the dried fruit rolls, which is apple, pear, strawberries, black carrot, apples, pears, raspberries, black carrot, and that's it. And it is $10.99 for a 48 count. But we're not buying processed food this month. Dang. Or even packaged foods like that, even with super healthy and delicious. This is another good one, except I believe this one they put natural flavors in this one. Yep, right down there, the natural flavors. So I would skip the pure organics. We've had them though, they're good. Go with the bare rolls over there. And I noticed that this is on sale and a lot of people are buying this gold standard way because it's $15 off. I would not buy this because it says artificially flavored, no artificial growth hormones. You flip it over here. Right there, protein blend, whey protein. There's the isolate, natural and artificial flavors, sunflower or soy, lichens, modified food starch. Oh goodness me, and the list goes on. So to me, this is a complete fake food. We use the protein from Flav City. Um, you can follow him here on YouTube. I've been using his protein powder his vitamin D, his C, for probably, well, since he's launched it. If this wasn't on sale, this is $63.99 for the fake stuff, for things you don't want in your body. His is $59.99, and if you get it on Amazon, sometimes there's deals, and if you order as like we do, like a subscription, there's discounts. And there we go. Cart's filling up, my crew. Hey guys, I'm gonna go finish grocery shopping. That's cool. Okay, so I'm gonna come over here and we're gonna get a golden box of butter. Could you grab a golden box of butter for me, Alex? Thank you. Okay, so here are one of the things that I would buy at Costco if you're looking for really good organic gluten-free rolled oats. They have the best price. This is a super good brand. We just ordered a 50 pound bag of oats from Azure. You'll see that video coming up once we pick up our order. So if you're looking for a good oatmeal in 2024, I would definitely come here and get the one degree oats. You do want to pass up, you do not want to buy Kirkland Signature Oats. I know they're cheaper for 10 pound bags, but they're not organic. Even though it just says whole grain rolled oats, these are not organic and it's super important that your oats are um, organic. Look at the maple syrup. Is it coming in that kind of container now? Oh no, they're smaller. That's a smaller bottle. $12.99. This is, says Kirkland maple syrup. Is it like a fancier one? A golden color, delicate taste, 2023. Okay, we'll buy Organic one. Organic maple syrup, yeah. Let's grab one. 
Okay. It's a little bit smaller. It's smaller by seven ounces and the price is about the same. Yeah. We can see if there's some on the end cap, but this might be what they brought in. This just might it's in glass. It's in glass. Oh, which I love. I know. So good. We yes. Just peanut can you grab two of those? And then we need an almond butter. And those are ten ninety nine. <laughs> Thank you. Did, you. did you guys like that? They love that. It's good stuff. Okay. So I one of those. You want to grab one of those, bud? Could you reach it? Thomas yeah, got it. Perfect. And then how about an almond butter? We'll get an almond butter too. Look at all my helpers. Thank you. Okay, so they still have the Kirkland Signature maple syrup for $11.99. Okay, so I'm actually gonna pick up both of them because then we'll just have it. I think this is more like a specialty syrup down there. So we'll get that one as well. And then I probably won't have to buy syrup for a couple of weeks. So when we were doing plant-based, we would go through uh -huh, two of these a week. So so much maple like syrup. Now it. these two will probably last us two, three weeks maybe. Like so much. When I look back on all the syrup, date syrup, fruit, lots and lots of like mangoes, bananas, things like that. So much fructose, so much sugar. Okay, we need sugar for kombucha. It's gonna be a Woo! Nine forty-nine. I do remember this being seven ninety-nine not too long ago. You got it, girl. Give it a toss. Way to go. Way to fix your hair. Yep. Looking good. So we need some almond flour. We're making chocolate chip cookies. Okay, there is for eight forty nine the no salt seasoning, and then organic paprika for six forty nine. That's a crazy good deal. I'm curious to know what kind of paprika it is. Um, I love Hungarian paprika. Oh my gosh, so good! But that's a really good price. They have paprika organic. Yeah, look at that. Okay, we need coconut oil. Can you grab one of those? $14.99. So, another great find as of January 2024 is the coconut oil. And then another really good oil here at Costco is the, the Kirkland Extra Virgin Olive Oil from Italy. It's one origin, which means everything is traceable. $17.49, 100% Italian Extra Virgin Olive Oil. It's a great find. You want the one from one origin here at Costco. Okay, so they have the Safe Catch Yellowfin Ahi Tuna. And I'm going to pick some of this up this week. We're going to do something a little bit different. I'm going to get two of these. There is 43 grams of protein per can. So we're going to get this Yellowfin Tuna. Mm -hmm. We're going to get two of those this week instead. Sound good? Mm -hmm. Perfect. $12.99. We need marinara. Thanks. Thanks. Just three. Okay. Three is good. You can find a spot. Perfect. Nice. Okay. Mm, oh, look at down here, have apple cider vinegar and balsamic right next to each other. Okay, great price, $9.49 for three of the organic North Coast apple cider vinegars. Good deal. And then for $12.99, we need the balsamic vinegar. There we go. All we need is raisins and we can go. We're picking up some flowers for my mother-in-law. I wonder if I like the way this one looks on the side. That one doesn't look like it's hanging on too well. Ooh, these look really good. That one right there looks really good. No, yeah, either one right in the center. Okay, now we gotta look at them. Uh, mm. Wait, can I look from above? That one melon has, or that, one of these two. This has more yellow. Grandma likes yellow. Grab that one's one. got a lot of those orange things that just stink. Oh, with this one. Okay. Keep praying for my mother-in-law. She is in the hospital. Nice. We're good, baby. Let's get raisins. Thank you. Okay, that is a wrap. We are all done for another week. I have lots and lots of helpers. Everyone's going to help unload. We're going to get this done really, really fast. Oh, goodness. Make it room.
Okay, that is a wrap. I think that's a really good grand total. We're gonna load up, we're gonna go visit my mother-in-law. We're gonna make something really delicious. And of course, I will drop the recipe down below for you. All right, guys, let's load up. This is a really simple breakfast and I'm losing my voice again. So I apologize ahead of time. Okay, so this really simple breakfast in the Instapot, we made two pounds of green northern beans and I have a video coming up in about a week and a half where we're gonna do all kinds of bean making in our Instapot. Last week, I had a lot of good responses on Instapot cooking and how to make all the different types of dry beans in an Instapot and what you can do with that. So look for that video coming up probably in the next week and a half or so, maybe two weeks. We're going to go over all the different kinds of beans. We're going to go over nutrition facts and then we're going to cook with them and I'm going to show you how to do it all in the Instapot. And it's super good, really simple. This is what they look like, but not for long. Okay, so everything is in here now. Now I'm just gonna mix everything up. Let's go set the table. <laughs> 